peace of the Most High God. You're you now listening to the Whole Truth Program coming to you from the sanctuary of the church in the Lord Jesus Christ of the Apostle of Faith Incorporated where Bishop Josie Tisdale is pastor and general overseer. Now let's bow our heads in prayer and meditations as they're led by Minister Evan. Gracious God, our Father, most holy and everlasting God, Lord, we thank you this morning, Lord God, for giving us the opportunity to come before you in prayer. Lord God, we thank you, Lord Jesus, and we're at your mercy today, Lord God, because we know, Lord God, that you know today who's going to be saved and who's not going to be saved. Lord God, we pray that you will bless us to walk the straight and narrow pathway with fear and trembling. Lord God, that we might walk in your salvation, Lord God, fearing to commit sin today, Lord God, because we know that you are the judge and judgment is going to come to pass, Lord God. Lord God, bless us to examine ourselves to see whether we be in the faith today, Lord God. Lord God, help us to see our crooked ways, Lord God, that we might make it straight with you today, Lord Jesus. Lord God, we need you, Lord God. We need you to heal our bodies, Lord God. We need for you to heal our minds, Lord God, where we're not thinking right all the time, Lord Jesus. Lord God, bless us to think holy. Bless us to live holy today, Lord God. Bless us to love one another today, Lord God, in the name of Jesus Christ. Lord God, we know we can't enter in if we hate our brother today, Lord Jesus. Lord God, we need you, Lord God, to help us in all areas of life, Lord God. Most of all, Lord God, that we might be obedient unto your word. Now, Lord, as the word begins to come forth, bless Bishop Tisdale, Lord God, that you might give him a word that will save men and women everywhere and cause them to repent today, Lord God. Lord Jesus, bless his mouth, bless his heart, and bless his mind today, Lord God. Bless those that are shut in, those that are sick and afflicted, Lord God. Those that are striving to be saved and bless the backslider, Lord God, that he might see his way, Lord God, and that he might return to the fold. In the name of Jesus Christ, we pray. Amen. Again, you're listening to the whole truth program. If you have any questions or comments concerning the Bible, you may mail your correspondence to the church in the Lord Jesus Christ of the Apostle of Faith Incorporated, Bishop Joe C. Tisdale, Post Office Box 2017, Hartsville, South Carolina, 29551. You can also call our toll-free number at 1-877-332-5661. You can also visit our website for additional church information, such as Belize, and calendar events as well as audio sermons preached by Bishop Tisdale. Our official website address is www.thechurchin.org. Now at this time, the choir will render a selection entitled, Christ is All. I don't possess houses or land, clothes or jewelry, sorrows and cares in this whole world.
is indeed an honor to present unto you the man of God, our pastor and general overseer, Bishop Joe C. Tisdale. We do give honor to our Lord, first of all, and Savior Jesus Christ. We do greet everybody, whoever you are, with much love, joy, and peace. May it be multiplied to everybody in the precious name of Jesus Christ. We are serving the Lord in that name. Amen. We didn't have the name, but Zacharias said the name was going to be one. Mm -hmm. And I thank God for giving us a name today to glorify him. Amen. Amen. <clears throat> the Lord told the people, some of his own people, said, how long shall I be with thee? He called him faithless mm -hmm. because he was trying to teach them of his ways and teach them that they should have faith. Amen. In the 11th chapter of the book of Mark, Jesus passing by the fig tree. Mm -hmm. And because it didn't have any fruits. And he desired a fig. It had the leaves all right. But it wasn't any figs on it. That's right. <clears throat> so Jesus cursed the tree. That it wouldn't bear any more. And after a while, they came back by, and Peter saw that the tree had withered away. You know, that's telling me something. When God examined the human family, God wants to find himself in us. Mm -hmm that we would bear fruits. Amen. Not only when it's good time, but in bad times too. Amen. God comes and inquire of us about fruits. We should have them. Amen. Amen. We shouldn't be like the fig tree. God looked to us for faith. We should have it. Amen. What does word say, read it? Mark 11 and 10, 12. All right. And on the morrow, when they were come from Bethany, he was hungry. Yes, Jesus was hungry. And seeing a fig tree afar off, having leaves, he came, if happily he might find anything thereon. See, I want God to be, find me happily, holy. That's right. Amen. Bible said, when he comes, shall he find faith on the earth? Amen. I'm praying God that somebody died in faith. Oh, yeah. In order to come up in the rapture, you have to be in some faith in Amen. God. Amen. Amen. What does it say, Rita? And when he came to it. When he, Jesus came to the fig tree. He found nothing but leaves. He found nothing but leaves. For well, the time of figs was not yet. Now, now, do you catch this? Now, if it was time for figs, it would have had figs, right? It had to leave. Looked like a fig tree, mm -hmm. but no fruits. That's right. God want us to bear fruits for him. Amen. Amen. So when he come to us and inquire of us, we are full of fruits. Amen. Amen. God can use us. That's right. Is that right? Amen. Amen. God can use Job mm -hmm. because he was a good man. It's still evil. 
so much God, but seemed like he was bragging a little on yeah. Joe, how good mm -hmm. a man he was. Mm -hmm. Y'all understand this? That's right. But what God allowed to happen to him, Job cried out, and he said, all the days of my life, he said, I'll wait till my change come. He never left his integrity. Mm -hmm. He held on, though he was going through much misery, much trouble. God could depend on Job. Jo. Amen. God knew what the man was doing. That's God right. knew the man was fasting. God knew the man was praying. And he said, uh, is, is it anybody like him? Mm -hmm. Is that right? That's right. Hit me a little bit with it, read it. Job 1 and 6. Amen. What did it say? Now there was a day, fifth verse, and it was so. It was so. When the day of their feasts were gone. Yes. Uh, gone about that Job sent and sanctified them. Yes, he did. Excuse me, I'm sorry. First verse. There was a man in the land of Uz whose name was Job, and that man was perfect and upright. Now, look at this. See, when God called on us to use us, while the night or day, That's right. we should be able to produce. That's right. Do you see what I'm saying? Amen. It, 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 it doesn't have to be in a convenient time for you. But God wants us where he can use us. That's right. God wanted fruits off of the fig tree. Mm -hmm. And the Bible said it wasn't a season for figs. <laughs> now, why would Jesus Christ go to a tree and know there's no figs on there and look for it and it's not there and he cursed it? Y'all ever thought about that? Why would Jesus do something like this? He's God Almighty. Amen. He could, he could make fruits on the tree. But he went there and there wasn't any figs there. Mm -hmm. That let me know that we supposed to be fruitful in the Lord. That's right. God may ask you any time to do something. Amen. When he looked, and it's because we are creation of God Almighty. Amen. We are made for his glory. Is that right? That's right. God need to depend on his glory. Amen. Say, go do this. Say, yes, Lord. May not be a convenient time. Is that right? That's right. May be a time when you're down and out. But the Lord right. can use you. That's right. Are we ready for God to use us today? I don't want to be cursed by God. That's right. That's right. If I'm cursed by God, amen, I don't have an opportunity. Oh, no. To be saved. Is that right? Amen. Give me some of read it. We and, and that man was time. perfect and upright. And, yes. And one that feared God and eschewed evil. Do you see this? Sixth verse. Now, there was a day when the sons of God came to present themselves before the Lord. All right. And Satan came also the among them. The devil was there. Devil, you're never going to get rid of the devil as long as you have flesh on and blood is the life of the flesh. You're never going to get rid of the devil Always. That's right. Not why we're here. Amen. He may leave you. When he comes back, it's another fight. Amen. Amen. You always got to be on your guard with the devil. Read it. Hurry, read it. And the Lord said unto Satan, Yes. Whence comest thou? Then Satan answered the Lord and said, yeah. From going to and fro in the earth and from walking up and down in it. All and right. the Lord said unto Satan, Hast thou considered my servant Job, All right. that there is none like him in the earth, All right. a perfect and an upright man, All right. one that feareth God and escheweth evil? All right. Then Satan answered the Lord and said, Doth well, Job fear God for naught? Oh, I mean, you got Job have a whole lot. Hast thou, hast thou not made an hedge about him right. and about his house uh -huh. and about all that he hath on every side that thou hast blessed the works of his hand all and right. his substance is increased in the land? Yes. But put forth thine hand now and touch all that he hath and he will curse thee to thy face. Now look at this devil. And the Lord said 